guys welcome back to my channel if you're new here this is that girl 254 and you're so much welcome and don't forget to like share and subscribe and comment down below so today i'm lucky to be joined by my good friend here joy <laughs> and today we are going to do this or that questions so yeah let's get started yeah get into it yeah hi guys i'm back again <laughs> okay so these are that questions so i think we're gonna start so we're going to use her phone yeah. okay so these are that i think i'm gonna start mm -hmm. uh would you rather have a vacation or a staycation i think i'll start so mm -hmm. i think for me a uh, vacation will do because i kind of feel like a staycation is more of like a home like in indoors mm -hmm. so and a vacation or rather even better a vacation <laughs> it's going out somewhere like you know um going for hiking or something outdoor or to the beach so for me i'd rather a vacation mm, for me i think i'll choose vacation because uh there's so many things to do around like there are so many places to visit eateries there's so many Italy, there's so many places to chill, like to rivers. Yeah, and vacation, for me vacation requires a lot of money because it, it requires traveling, buying stuff, and my pockets. <laughs> Zina Kata. So, Pole, Pole so. State. Moving on. So next is, uh, would you rather Netflix or chill or read a book? For me, uh, I'd rather read a book. Oh my goodness. Read a book. Can you imagine just being in a place that is so quiet, uh, the ambience is so cool, and you with your book, you know, you can visualize uh, your characters and the environment, there's so many things, and it's so relaxing. Yeah. I think we tend to disagree on so many things, mm -hmm. because um, Netflix and chill is for me, I'm too lazy to read, it's not, a, it's not like I don't like reading, but well, I'd rather just sit on the couch with uh, a snack or a drink and just watch a movie or something. So yeah, Netflix and chill for me. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay. So uh, next up we have, are you a morning person or a night person? A night person because, you know, I can stay all night. Like I can do stuff, uh, a lot of stuff over the night, during the night than during the day. Because uh, I agree with you. <laughs> Mm -hmm. I'm also a night person. Um, in the morning, I'm so moody and gloomy, and I don't know. And you're, like, you're so sleepy. Yeah, yeah. And but... I think that is because we stay up uh, late <laughs> at night, mm -hmm. so mornings don't really why. work for us. So mm -hmm. we choose the night. Yeah, yeah. At least now I know mm -hmm. we have something in common. Okay, so maybe we'll go on to the next. So, would you rather be rich and famous? Or rich and unknown, like totally unknown, but rich you're super unknown. rich. Rich and unknown. You won't, you won't have the pressures of the world that someone is following you around. At you, you can't even you can't even buy stuff. Like come on, you can't even thrift things because people will be like, look at this person. You have all the money in your thrifting. You'll be trending. But when you're rich and unknown, you can you can do so much stuff. You have your freedom. Mm -hmm. You don't have people following you around. First of all, who will know you're rich? <laughs> I think, okay, on that, maybe I'll pose a question, uh, question to our viewers. So, one question for me is, is it possible for someone to be actually rich and unknown? I think uh, you can give us your thoughts and comments uh, down below. Because I don't really think someone will actually be, actually be rich and unknown at don't the same time. Me. But at the same time, I totally agree with you that I'll rather be rich and unknown because I want to have my bank account, you know, like full of money, but I wouldn't want to walk around uh, being famous and popular, everyone knowing you and all that. So yeah, that's, I think that's another thing we mm -hmm. share in common. So yeah. But anyway, guys, give us your comments down below and let think? us know what you think. Yeah. Okay. So uh, next thing, would you rather be a passenger or the driver? Passenger, cause I don't even know how to drive. So, that, <laughs> <laughs> so for now, let me enjoy as a class. Cause they will reach a time when you are allowed to back left. I'm saying, sour. Oh. And then you can enjoy. 
because for me i'll rather drive myself um i don't have my dl yet but um i'm learning so <laughs> i'll rather drive myself because i think um sometimes you tend to wonder what is this driver thinking when they are maybe over speeding or trying to overtake and all that so probably sometimes i feel like i'll be more safer when i'm the one you know uh control controlling the steering wheel mm -hmm. but anyway i have someone uh, to drive me guys <laughs> I'm lucky. Yeah, you're lucky. You're lucky. <laughs> okay, so I think we move on to the next. So, would you rather visit an art museum or a history museum? I think I mean uh, a history museum is so boring. Why would I want to learn about the past? Explains why she never did history in school. Yeah. So yeah. Geography people. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm also interested in art. Um, well, art is a bit more interesting, I might say. And you know, the only difference with art, an art museum and a history museum, is that you know, the history museum, what happens is that you're going to visit some something in the ancient. It doesn't keep on evolving, you know. But with the art, you know, it gets better every day. There is innovations, creativity, and all that. So. Yeah, I'll also go with um, visiting the art museum. And then in the art museum, you get to see how creative people are. Exactly, exactly, yeah. So, it's interesting. Yeah. <laughs> so, would you travel by a train or an aeroplane? So, between the railway and air? I think it depends. The times you want to explore. Mm -hmm. Can we choose both at the same time? I mean, just <laughs> be free, be free. Because uh -huh. I think sometimes you want to explore, you, you feel like, uh, you know, when you travel by train, there's so many things that you can see. Mm -hmm. Animals, uh, you can see many, maybe upcoming designs, or you can tell what's happening in the world. But plane, the plane is too fast. And if, you're, if you're required to be at a certain place, urgently mm -hmm. then i choose a plane yeah my air and, would really work yeah out. and if you're you've been so busy and you're tired and you just want to relax you have to reach your destinations as fast as possible i think you can choose air yeah, yeah that's me okay for me uh for me uh if i was to choose i'll definitely go for the airplane because at the end of the day i tend to feel like uh the train is a bit too slow for me and i'm always those people who Chop chop, you know, I want to get there, get my shit done and I'm back home. So yeah, I'll definitely go. I'll definitely go for airplane. Yeah? Yeah. So okay, moving on. Uh huh. This one is a tricky one. So would you rather owe me money or owe me a favor? I've personalized you. that one. So yeah. I'd rather owe you money. Cause you know, uh, you can limit yourself to the amount of money. See any kama kofama thingy? Probably, yeah, yeah, yeah. But uh, what I'm thinking, yeah, like I said, the question is a bit tricky. You can the amount of money that yes. you can be owed. Yeah. But uh, a debt, uh, no, not a debt, but favor. A favor, yeah. Uh, a favor. <clears throat> Maybe in a kubwa, maybe your expectations are too much. Maybe it goes so high. Season you want to be so you're like you owe someone a favor. Now do your favor, nini? Maybe you want to come to Nigeria, get in a taxi True, true. Yeah, I think with that one, like I said, it's a bit tricky question because um it tends with uh each and every person's uh, expectations. Mm -hmm. So yeah, but for you, for, for me, uh, I'd rather owe you a favor because i think i'll get away with it you know mm -hmm. but when it comes to money sometimes you tend to be so broke and i don't want you to be asking me for money <laughs> but you know uh, you can always find a way of paying someone's money but i feel you know i live with a graduate that like, i did this money for, for you joy, and you and never then, you know return the favor yeah. back so mm -hmm. yeah and it's maybe, a tricky one no, imagine uh you did something for me maybe i really needed your help and you came through for me and then it reaches, your, it reaches your time, you're supposed to maybe travel to the US or I don't know where. You're supposed, you want to go to Dubai and you don't have enough. Uh, you don't have, let's say, let's say I'm working at uh, a certain company mm -hmm. that's in your uh, travel, single. Uh -huh. So maybe you want to go on a vacation maybe with your boyfriend or your girlfriend to Dubai. And at that time, you don't have offers. And because I'm working in that company, you expect me to give you a free offer. Any, I give you an offer with zero charges uh -huh. 
I stand for you for everything. Any, it's it's so any. I don't I think totally any, get it. Yeah. yeah. For you, money, favor, you'd rather go for the money. I'd rather go for money, bro. Okay, okay. So the next one is a pretty uh, basic question that I think everyone, who might be on their first date, they actually end up asking each other. So, are you a coffee or a tea person? <laughs> Imagine for me, I'd rather do coffee. Like I wake up coffee. I I I I sleep coffee. Like. Coffee, coffee yeah, coffee, and I don't understand because with tea, I feel like you might get addicted to it. Mm -hmm. And another thing, if you're a night person, like you say you are, I think coffee will really work for you. Should try that. Maybe I will, you, you change your mind. <laughs> Maybe <laughs> I'm not so sure. Okay. <laughs> okay. So, 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 moving on to the next question, um, would you rather be embarrassed or be afraid? Hmm. So, um, in what scenario are you putting yourself in? Ah, uh, cause when you when you're afraid, that means cause everything you're, you're trying to do everything scared. So you'd rather not live in I'd rather, fear. Yeah, you'd rather, I'd rather be not... embarrassed, ashamed, mm -hmm. and uh, face it. You know, face your yeah, fear. Face your... Get embar get embarrassed, get ashamed. But at the end of the day, you're not living in fear or you're afraid of anything. Cause oh when you're God. when you're when you're scared, then you 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 won't get anything done. So true, true, true. Because yeah. if you're scared of traveling, so and you you want to do something to do with traveling, how are you going to get your your things done? Yeah. yeah. So you, I'd rather be embarrassed. You know, people will still talk, but uh, the courage that I have, I'll get through it. True. And I think by embarrassment, um, depending on what situation you are in, I think if you've ever been embarrassed before, I think when you are out of it after that feeling, you can feel more stronger. So I'll also go with um, I'd rather be embarrassed than even in fear. So yeah. I, would I rather call you first thing in the morning or call you in the middle of the night? First thing in the morning. <laughs> and let it not be too early. Don't call me at six. By first thing in the morning, it means anytime I wake up. It doesn't mean, it doesn't it doesn't talk about <laughs> what time you wake up. If I wake no, up at five, I'm gonna call you first thing in the morning, like literally when I wake up. Because you see, mm -hmm. the other option That's is I call you in the middle of the night. The middle my of the night. middle of the night could be at four. But you're my next middle person, of the night. you're the next person, so I assume you you slept at six. Oh so you call me at nine. I'll call you at nine. <laughs> Okay, me too. You'd rather call me first thing in the morning than call me in the middle of the night because I'll probably be asleep. Either I, I won't pick your call or I'll just ignore it. Like, no? I think it's so weird at the middle of the night. What are you doing? Unless you're sick. 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 Unless so, yeah, yeah. We are heavy sleepers. <laughs> okay, so aha. Uh -huh. Would you rather take photos or videos? Another videos. Yeah, I'd rather go for videos as well because they tend to be I'm a lively person. So I'd rather show you my facial expression with a lot of you know. A video will be will be much better. For yeah, me. a video will capture yeah. lots of stuff True. compared to photos. Yeah. You know? Yeah. But photos still do. They still work, I mean, yeah. But nowadays, I also feel like um, you can take photos. You can, you can, you can screenshot, you can screenshot videos to get the photos. True. Yeah, yeah, sure. So, uh huh. Would you rather uh, get social media messages or text messages? Uh text messages. Direct text messages. Like, if I'm texting you and I'm texting you a direct text, or if I text you on social media. Social media is like WhatsApp, uh, Facebook, Instagram. So, okay. what would you rather? I prefer text messages because sometimes maybe I'm, I'm not even online. So maybe you have there's an urgency to something, mm -hmm. and you send me a message on WhatsApp and then I don't see it. I see it. I see it when it's already late. So I prefer you send me a message. At least a message. It, it's a poor purple. It's a one that is a message. And okay. yeah. So okay. you need to decide whether I'll read it and uh, get back to you or, or not. You. <laughs> okay. For me, text messages, direct ones, don't work for me unless it is really, really necessary. Me in Jaku text WhatsApp, Facebook, I'm an messenger, Instagram. and Instagram. If you don't respond, if it's really, really that urgent, I'd rather call you. So for me, social media works. So um, next question is, uh, is, would you take a friend? Actually, let's personalize this. Mm -hmm. Would you rather take me to your family vacation or would you rather join 
my family vacation. I'd rather take you. Rather take me to yeah, you. You feel like my family is boring. Ah, no, <laughs> not really, not really. At least I'm going to have a break down here. Activities and stuff are not as in I'm part of, I'm part of the planning. Yeah, you know, and you'll be more comfortable. I'll be more comfortable being with your family mm-hmm. than a different family. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I think that also works for me. If I'm joining a group of friends, okay, but for family, family. it tends to be a bit restrictive. So I'd rather make you join mine because I'll be more comfortable. So yeah, I think for that one, we can't yeah. very much. Okay, so next question is: uh, Would you rather have a group hangout? Or one on one hangout, like would you rather have us like when we want to hang out, mm-hmm. like three, four, five people a group. joining us, yeah. or just the two of us? A group, cause it, it will be more fun. Mm-hmm. We have different uh likes and dislikes, so we can try to try to explore each others. True. Then, I think I agree with you. I think I agree with you on that. Cause for me, one on one hangouts, unless it's been bored. like a terrible so, two years and we've not seen each other, uh, I'll definitely want to date. And like, then if you have uh, you up. have lots of activities to do, mm-hmm. you know, a group sometimes preparation. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. But, uh, you take so much time preparing yourself, so you get you yeah. end up getting late. But two people, so what, what are we choosing here? <laughs> It depends. It depends on the yeah, occasion. Yeah, I think it depends on the occasion. But like you said, you'd rather have a group hangout because the more the merrier, right? Mm-hmm. So yeah, the more Especially the merrier. Especially if it's a road trip, two people, it will be too boring. But a group yeah. at least it will work. Yeah. yeah. Mm-hmm. Okay, so uh, moving on. Okay, do you like sharing food or don't you like sharing the food? I'm free. I can share food. I don't have issues. Generosity <laughs> level. <laughs> you can share our foods. For know. me, I feel like if I have a craving, mm-hmm. I might tend to be a bit selfish. Like for instance, we are going to pretend we didn't hear that. Okay, Missy wale wasi ati msi aki nokumlango na limepika kuku nita picha. But the thing is this: if it's enough, I'll share. But there's that part. Imagine like um, I just wanted to have ice cream. And I just bought ice cream for myself, and I had a craving. Me, I won't share my ice cream with you. Aki me. For I'm me, I'll like be like, you. <laughs> me, I won't share it with you. Or like, I'm having like a burger or a hot dog, and you come and join me. And unless I buy, if I have the money, I'll buy it for you. If I don't, Aki, oi, call it. Call it too. Yeah, just get yours because I'm not gonna share. <laughs> Just give me, but see, we can finish yours and then I get, if you're not, I'll just see. But why you finish add, mine and then no, purchase yours? I mean, no, I mean, no, no. Generous. I can't even buy you two burgers. That is pretending I'm generous. Burgers. That is pretending that I'm being generous. Me, I'm just, I'd rather be honest, you know? Like, yeah, so, <laughs> okay. me, no sharing, no sharing. <laughs> okay, so, between Instagram and Twitter. Instagram. Instagram. I think okay, I also please. go for Instagram. Maybe I think we are too. Are we too young for Twitter? Mm. Twitter tends Twitter to be kind of complicated. I, mean, I don't even think I use my Twitter account, and if I do, rarely. So yeah, we both I don't go even for have, Instagram. I don't even have a Twitter account also, wow. and I don't even have Twitter on my phone. So <laughs> I, I know nothing about Twitter generally. No, we just go around. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, next question. Would you rather do shopping online or shopping in a store? Shopping in a store. No shopping online. You're not no, even sure of what you want. Because I'm, I'm used to shopping online, so yeah. Uh, for me, I would if this if I was asked this question uh, a year ago, I would say shopping in a store. But right now, since I ended up um, having a very tight uh, working schedule at my workplace. I think I normally shop online and uh, it works for me. So at this point, shopping online. So sometimes you can shop well. something. You can shop something online and then you get disappointed. Maybe the quality. Yeah, but uh, yeah. that's there on are those, rare occasion. Okay, sure. There are those, yeah, there are those advantages it's and disadvantages of everything mm-hmm. in life. So yeah, sometimes shopping online, you could really, really, really get disappointed. But I think um, you just need to do your due diligence before purchasing items online. Mm-hmm. So. Yeah. You, know, even, you can do even shopping for house, house, household items. Yes, online. online, and it saves you a lot, a lot of, of time. time. Yeah, yeah. So yeah, um, I think I'll go to the next question, which is, aha, uh-huh. would you rather have tattoos or piercings? Piercings. I can tell. I'd rather have a million piercings. 
but not at all. Am I allowed to speak none can... of the above? Because <laughs> <laughs> imagine you you put a tattoo on your arm and then after maybe one two years you get mm-hmm. bored of it. You start a uh, rabbi, I don't know. You start a piercing is also tattoo. permanent. Yeah, if but you decide piercing... to get a piercing on your nose or a piercing on your but it can get blocks. After a while, okay, yeah, probably, can, maybe. I don't know nothing about tattoos and guess. piercings because the only piercing I have is my uh, earring piercing, only one. You have a couple, yeah, so I know you are pierced if you have dog. I don't know you are. <laughs> <laughs> maybe if I had the choice, I would, you know, go for none of the above. None of the above. Yeah. So, but if you don't have a choice, you have to choose one. I'll go, I'll, go, I'll go for a tattoo, a pretty tiny one. Something you know, that I like. But you know tattoos are addictive. You put one here, makes you think of putting one here. Piercings are addictive as well. Yes. I, I, I'm sure it's going to win that conversation. <laughs> so moving on swiftly. Uh-huh. So, would you rather uh, plan? Mm-hmm. Would you rather have plans or get surprised? Pla- I'd rather plan. Because I'm not that, the kind of a pastor when until you come to me and see so now my hair is easy. Hey, bro, I need to prepare myself. <laughs> I'm gonna, to I'm gonna take you. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna bust your bubble on that. Mm-hmm. If you really love planning, I think serious relationships are gonna be a hard problem for you. Are you sure about that? As a dating person, we want our boyfriends to surprise us each and every day. So for me, surprises really work well, especially from unless your, you're coming, unless your, you're coming your with your the full partner. package, unless you're coming with the full package. Ask her to take photos. After taking one, I'm prepared. Okay. Maybe you're, maybe you're for person, the yeah. Instagram person, moment, you know, you know, you know, you know, imagine you're young. That's why you, you always need to be ready. You need to be ready every day. Okay. Anyway, so moving on, uh, pizza or Chinese food? Pizza. Even me, pizza. Chinese food tends to be a bit. Okay, not to be offensive, to me, but streets, as in a yeah. Area. And I'm not even <laughs> learned how to use the Chinese, uh, whatever. Mm. Sushi for me in Yaribikia, so um, I don't know Second. for other peeps. Maybe maybe it wasn't made well. I don't know. I don't know. For but me, for me, I already cancelled out Chinese yeah, food. Chinese food, it a lot of, a lot of raw. It con a lot of raw stuff. That is what I know. But anyway, uh, pizza would really work well. Me pizza anytime, any day. So. Pizza for breakfast. Yeah. Okay, so let's go to uh huh. Would you rather have an iPhone or an Android phone? An Android phone. Cause I have one. <laughs> so for me, iPhone anytime, <laughs> any day. <laughs> let's make that question very clear. I'm gonna jump in there. I'm gonna jump to argue. Sawa sawa. So now. Okay, like you can let your iPhone say the kaza. Unta choose. Unta neza. I'm gonna keep my iPhone very far away from you so that you don't uh, go with it. <laughs> so, uh, parting short question: um, Would you rather date a tall or a short guy? Wow, that's that's a great, that's a great question. question. I wasn't expecting that question. At all. How do I date a short person? And I'm also short. What sort of quality? I think we are both short, so short girls tend to date uh, tall, tall men. Guys. Yeah. So, so how are you feel like a kubebo. Okay, I, since I'm like pretty small, I believe I'm portable. So you want someone who's taller than you, who's got but a you can be and and there. Kwa, kwa ngubu, so. hey, My boyfriend <laughs> is strong, man. My boyfriend is strong, so yeah. Okay. So guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope you liked the video. And please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And comment down below. Yeah, share as many times as you can. Yeah, we love you guys. See you on our on the next video that we're going to shoot. Bye. Bye guys. Until next time. Adios. <laughs>